It's no secret that Halloween really started a month ago, so we might as well jump on the bandwagon and make some spooky things to eat. Now, here to help us with dessert is Sophia Wright from Cakes for Causes. Sophia, thank you for coming back. Thank you for having me. It's such a pleasure, and like we teased a little earlier, we're going to make some spooktacular cookies. That's yes. what you guys put in your paperwork. I yes. love that. We, we thought it was pretty clever. <laughs> <laughs> and they're sugar cookies, and, and you're going to actually show us how to make the sugar cookie. Yeah, so our recipe's online, um, cakesforcauses.org. We're just going to run through a couple basic steps. Um, the idea of this is to, to give you an idea of how easy it is to make sugar cookies and some foolproof tips and tricks to make it easy. So in the blender right here, we've got our eggs, we've got sugar and butter beaten, and then in here we have some flour, baking powder, and salt. Mm -hmm. So what you're going to do is going to add about half of this flour um, mixture into your batter mm -hmm. and mix it up. So let it dry into the wet. Always remember yes. that. And if someone doesn't have a fancy mixer like that, they can just do it by hand, right? They could do it by hand. Okay. If you have a hand mixer, um, you can use a fork as well. Okay. Growing up, uh, we didn't have fancy mixers, so we used forks. <laughs> so you had some good forearms. Yes. You're saying. You had to really mix it in there. Perfect. That was my workout for the day. <laughs> <laughs> so you burn the calories before you cook the calories. Yeah. That, that's a good way to do it. All right, so it's all incorporated there. So after this is all mixed, you want to mix it on low. Mm. And then once that's done, you're going to um, keep it in your bowl. It's crucial to chill um, sugar dough. So you want to chill this in enough fridge for about an hour, okay. up to a day you can. Um, but that's what's going to give you the best sugar, sugar cookie dough. Um, once it's chilled, you're going to bring it out and then roll it. So we already pre-rolled it out for you. And I would roll it to about a quarter of an inch out. And then once it's rolled, you just take your cookie cutters mm -hmm. and then cut out your cookie. There you go. That's a little Batman or a little bat signal. Yep. Or just a bat. I mean, if you're, Oops. you know, normal. Excellent. Broke it. That's okay. Um, keep doing that. And then once you have your extra, you roll it out again and just keep getting just as many cookies going. out as possible. And then you bake it and you get these fun little shapes and we're going to decorate it. What kind of things can you use to decorate cookies? So you can use anything and everything. We've got a couple things you can buy from the store. They make color spray, which was done on this cookie here. Ooh, which like a tattoo. Yeah. You just kind of use, I use actually this lace pattern here and sprayed it. Um, you can use fondant, so you can either pre-make fondant or you can buy it. We have fondant here. What you would just do is you roll it out, um, mm -hmm. cut it with the cookie cutter, mm -hmm. and then paste it to your cookie using some decorating gel. Excellent. Super easy. Decorating gel. And is that sort of what we have here? Cookie icing, which is, I guess, similar. Yeah. And we have some little eyes, too. So let's get to decorating because I'm kind of excited to do that. Yeah. And while we do that, tell me about the upcoming events that you guys have coming up. So um, we're going to be serving at Zooson, which um, is a fun event that the zoo puts mm -hmm. on every year. It's October 13th. Um, and what we do is um, we provide sweet treats for them. You buy a ticket, you go in, and you can go and try different cookies and different... Um, <laughs> I don't know. Ooh. It wasn't coming out, so I took the top off. So, um, so and you can try yeah. fun treats. Excellent. Mm, got some on my finger. So with this icing, you can either do what Alex did and just throw it right on the cookie and hey, spread it out. Um, don't be shy. Which exactly? The more frosting, the merrier, you right? Got to go with it. Yeah. Or you can um, also outline the cookie. Yeah. See, that's the fancy, better way to do it. Let me show. Let me take some stuff out of the yeah. way so they can see it. So what you do with royal icing is you first do your outline. Mm -hmm. um, once you do your out outline, you can just fill it in. And it's easy to, if you make mistakes while you're doing the outline or fill it in, to just kind of fill it in like you did with your spatula Perfect. or a pen or anything. Excellent. So let's talk about some of the events that you guys have done. I know we have some pictures uh, of some stuff that you've begged. You guys are always doing things around the community. Always. Yeah, we've got um, our American Ops coming up. So we bake treats and then provide them for the 162nd Air Guard. Mm. And we take treats to them. Um, we have bake days coming up. We have big bake days where we all get together and just bake a whole bunch of treats for um, Tour Day Tucson. It's a lot of fun. We just get together and just bake. Beautiful. Yeah. Yeah, you guys are always doing stuff. You're always looking for volunteers too. And so we, we might as well show a final product here uh, of our beautiful <laughs> one second cookie creations. Mine uh, kind of looks like a demented ghost and yours for some reason has its eyes on its arms and she's I, and I, googly eyed she's for him. googly so. eyed for him. Oh, are they a pair? Yeah. How sweet. <laughs> what, what happens if they get together and kiss? Oh, now they look all weird. Anyway, so yeah, thank you so much for coming. It's always fun when you guys come. Thank you for everything you do in the community. I can't wait to try these weird ghosts.
Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs> now, guys, be sure to visit the Cakes for Causes booth at ZeusCon and on Friday, October 13th at Reed Park. To learn more, call 303-7893 or visit cakesforcauses.org.